Yo, I wanted to do a quick review of the Rhino Arc 2 slider. Uh, this is my studio. I've put, uh, invested a lot in this. And I have the Rhino Arc 2 slider. I'm not going to show you videos and images of it working because you've probably already watched that on YouTube. But I'm just going to give you my actual real world review and why I believe my review is important. And I think that you should get this. Um, I have like six YouTube channels. We got like 100 million views total, believe it or not. <laughs> And I've got nice cameras here. I mean, I've got the C70 and tripods. I've got the 1DX Mark II and the Ronin. And I've got drones and cameras and lenses. And I mean, this is my life. This Rhino Arc II slider is freaking dope. And here's why. Here's why. Okay. Before I bought this, I've called around. I watched 100 videos, probably just like you. And these other sliders, I've got other sliders I'm not even going to show you that I've wasted money on, hundreds and hundreds of dollars on these cheap little sliders. They'll be like shaky, wobbly when they get to the end of the parallax loop movement. They'll, they'll like go like this and then they'll go back or like there will be a micro jitter. Like you'll be watching the playback on the video. It'll be like just some little tiny and it's just... Ugh. And you're like, you get what you pay for. So after watching the top YouTubers and videographers and filmmakers for the money, the Rhino Arc 2 slider. I mean, dude, this was like 3000 bucks or something with the whole setup and the focus module and everything on, an, on a good tripod. Bro, I've taken this on video shoots with me. And you know what I think? Once you learn how to use it, it's great. I'm trying to see if there is a micro jitter. No, when everything's super tight, it's super, super smooth. It's beautiful. But it's expensive. But after you cough up the money and you just buy the dang thing or put it on a credit card and paid it off quick, once you've used it in your first shoot and you learn how to use it and you get confident with it, you're like, I'm so glad I bought that thing. And it's this is, you know why? Because... You could pay a videographer to come out with a gimbal and all that stuff, which which you can, but there are some shoots where you don't have to. Like, you're probably a videographer yourself, but I'm talking about, like, this is like a second videographer. Bro, you can do... I did this commercial. It pans over. I'll put links in the description below for a video that I did completely all by myself. It'll pan over, lock in on Zoom, and then, like, you can walk away. And you can keyframe it to then do this next thing. It'll do all this robotic shit, dude. It's just amazing. Okay, I'm, I gotta go. I must hop on a Zoom call. But just buy the thing. Oh, and they're not paying me to say that. It's just dope.